hey everyone welcome back uh, so in this video i will be showing you on how this how the uh, how the visor of this helmet can be removed uh, in order to uh, place a new visor uh, but the visor for this product is uh, not available on any e-commerce website so you will have to go to the company's official website uh, vega auto dot com in order to you know this is their url so you'll have to go to this website if you want to buy a, a smoke visor or a mercury visor so there are like two visors for this like they have a dark visor which you can use it in the sunlight and there's this mercury helmet mercury visor so i think the uh, price for the smoke is around 215 and the mercury is around 260 uh, so I'll just show you on how we can remove this first you have to take a minus uh, screwdriver I don't know where this came in from yeah so you need to use a minus screwdriver and you need to carefully uh, look for the opening I mean there's a small opening over here they which they have given so just make sure you know if you see over here I don't know whether you are able to see or not mm, so so we as we can see this this here is the opening over here so if you just put this in and you should do this very carefully okay because i am very particular about my helmet in order on not to damage my helmets so so as you can see you know there are let me just pull this outside okay so if you see there are you know two uh, pointed thing okay over here which goes in here and here and there's a screw over here and this is where the gap was for opening the uh, helmet okay and if you see on the back side of this it is written as x1 dash l l means left side so this is the left side uh, so they have given uh, they have pointed out you know on which side uh, this part belongs to so that we don't put it mistakenly put it as left as right and right as left so what i'll do is i'll just take a big screwdriver <laughs> and because i don't want to use the screw a small one uh, the small one might end up damaging uh, the uh, uh, the screw and uh, the screw uh, it's it's pretty difficult to get these kind of screws in the market so please make sure that you don't damage the screw and uh, make it as carefully as possible okay so if you open it and also make sure that you don't uh, you know put pressure on the other side and make it tighter instead of making it loose because that can break the visor as well so if you see oh, wow, okay so let's do it by hand so on on this also you need to be very careful okay so what you can do is you can actually uh, do it by hand and uh, you can remove this and as you can see okay over here this is the part so now this part is also marked if you see there's a l mark on it which indicates it's a part from the left side and uh, so we'll just keep it aside and as you can see now so this is uh, you know this is how we have removed the visor and as we removed it on the left side you can do the same at right side as well uh, now if you want to put the uh, uh, new visor then uh, you just need to i mean if you are able to see there's a small uh, pointed part over here so you need to place you know accordingly in this correct manner so if you see this is the part where it where this ends so you need to place this and uh, just put pressure or uh, by one finger like this and keeping your other hand you know inside the helmet like this so hold it like this so none of the part goes flying away when you are trying to tighten it out and as you can see there's a square and uh, you have to place this like this and this goes here like this is the first uh, part and this goes in like this and 
I'll just place the screw inside this. I'll just use my hand to okay so done that and let's take the uh, big screwdriver again and try to fix it okay. okay so that's it that is fixed now we will be placing the uh, cover back again um, So I'll just put it closer so that so first what you need to do is that you actually uh, need to put into these two slots very carefully so that you don't end up breaking it because once you break it then uh, it won't fit well so you have to be very careful when it comes to this it's uh, it's a bit tricky so once this is when then you put in the lower side below and you get a click sound so yeah so that's uh, how it is and uh, let me tell you I mean, this is my own helmet I mean I brought it with my own money I did not get paid for making this video or uh, I did not uh, I mean no one sponsored this helmet to you so sorry to me <laughs> so yeah so, you can use this uh, cloth to clean the clean your helmet and keep it in a good condition okay so yeah that was all about on how to remove the visor for this helmet vega atom